Good morning guys, today is day two. I think this is gonna be a little bit of a story time video. I am gonna record a workout, but I just wanted to share with you guys what happened to me today. So, uh, Miley had a dentist appointment. Miley is my middle child. I'll enter a clip here. All right, so we go to this dentist appointment today at 10 o'clock in the morning. She didn't go to school. Um, she gets her cap put in, everything is fine. I drop her back off at home right after I drove her by McDonald's and got her an ice cream. Leave her here and I take my behind to work. Here I am in my work clothes. I'm at work for about two hours and I get a phone call from Betty, my nanny. She stays here at my house while I work and watches the kids. And she tells me that she's been looking for Miley for the past 10 minutes and she has no idea where Miley is. And I said, okay, well, calm down. Maybe she's hiding. Have you screamed throughout the whole house? Have you checked in every bedroom? Obviously, you know, look in the gym, check everywhere, go outside. No, we couldn't find Miley. She hangs up on me. She said, I'm gonna look, I'll call you back. Anyway, long story short is, 20 minutes go by. Nobody knows where the hell Miley is. Now I'm starting to panic. So I leave my job, rushing here. I work probably a good, 40 minutes away from my house. I got to my house in 15 minutes. How? I don't know. Get to my house, my heart is pounding. Right as I'm pulling in, I get a phone call from my nanny saying that she found Miley. Miley decided to walk to her bus stop and wait for her sister. It's not even time for her sister to come back from school yet, okay? But Miley just decided to not tell anybody and just walk off to the bus stop that's probably like two blocks away from my house without saying anything. So as soon as I get home, guess what I did? First of all, she couldn't understand what I was saying because I was yelling. I was yelling really, really loud, okay? Because I was pissed. And then, and then I told her she's grounded for the rest of the day. And she was crying. She said, Mommy, blah, blah, blah. I don't even know what she was saying because I didn't give her the opportunity to explain herself because she should know better. She should not be leaving this house or going anywhere without asking for permission first. Do you guys agree or what? Did I handle this poorly? I know that I handled it the best way that I know how, but now, 20 minutes later is when my heart rate, I think, is going back to normal. So many things crossed my mind. I thought maybe she went to the mailbox and somebody picked her up and took her. Maybe, you know, one of the landscapers. I don't know. Like, just this horrific, crazy shit. My nanny's losing her mind, too, because nobody knows where this kid is at. And she just decided that she was going to walk two blocks away to the bus stop. She didn't go to school today because she had a dentist appointment. And wait for her sister when it's not even time for the bus to drop off the kids without even saying anything, without even asking for permission. Like, what the fuck? Kids, no, can't do that. All right, we just got our warm up out of the way and our stretches. We're gonna start off the actual workout with 100 push ups, and we're gonna rotate between us. So I'll do 10. The next person will do 10, and the next person will do 10, and then back to me until we've all completed 100. Let's do it. Nine, ten. All right, the next workout that we're gonna do after we complete our 100 push-ups is these shoulder press, and I'm gonna show you guys right now. Doing 15 pounds. Alright, next workout is going to 
be four sets of flies. We're gonna use 10 pounds and five pounds for this next exercise. Like this. Two, three, four, After those flies, we're going to go ahead and do lateral raises. We're going to do four sets of ten. Same weight. I'm doing ten pounds. She's doing ten pounds and she's doing five pounds. So try that out to see what weight you're at and do four sets of ten. on the cable machine one's gonna be targeting the shoulders the other one's gonna be targeting the tricep and then somebody's gonna be over here with the dumbbells doing um, dumbbell curls so here's what they look like so she's keeping her arms straight at all times and she's kind of rotating her core just like that we're gonna do 20 reps over here we have somebody with the dumbbells just doing um, 20 reps but one Two. All right, and this last one, we're gonna be on the cable machine. It's gonna, it's gonna target your triceps. I want you to slightly bend over and just uh, go down like this to target your triceps. So we're gonna do 20 reps on this machine as well, all right? time which is a really really good workout we're gonna do some assisted pull-ups on the bar I'll do the first five then the girls will do it and we're just gonna finish up the last couple of minutes doing this just like this our workout it was a really good upper body workout if you like this video make sure you give me a thumbs up leave me comments down below sorry about the rant in the beginning of this video I had a rough day we all do but there's nothing a good workout can't fix so get active get fit start working out start today or tomorrow or whenever you watch this video start bye guys <laughs>